Time for us to continue our adventures with Subnautica, and I am just basically trying to stab a bunch of fish right now. Our uh, real purpose here in the near term is to get back to a base where we can actually grab a drink or food or anything, all of it. I have space for one more. Uh, that's going to be our uh, one of our goals. The other goal is to actually go in well, get our sub back. Which basically mean we're gonna have to get some power cells and then maybe put in a charger on that sub that's kind of where we are and uh, yeah we'll see where that takes us so we got to get our sub back do a little bit of modding of it I think is the best way to describe it we're gonna try to get ourselves back to one of the bases here alpha base Seek fluid intake immediately. Yes, I know, I know. I am desperate for some fluid intake. Just to see if we can scooch through here without too much hassle. It's like, I'm wasting all this time catching fish, but, uh... I guess it's worth it? Oh my gosh, it just got super dark. Super dark, everyone. Oh, jeez, dude, you scared the you know what out of me. So, yeah, that's kind of where we are. We've got the code now to build our rocket. We're going to have a look at what's required in terms of ingredients for that at some point this episode. Like I said, my main goal here is to make our way back to Alpha Base and. Uh, Deal with our sh our shortage here of. Jeez, scared the oh, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Let's just go. Where is Alpha Base? Alpha Base. Hopefully, we can just go to Alpha and leave everything else behind us. Yeah. Ah. Uh... <laughs> Maybe we'll rescue Veronica this episode. I'll, I'll have to think about that one. That warper is a real pain in the you know what. Seek fluid intake immediately. I know. I've got 500. I'm hurting. I'm dying. Food is not an issue. Let's go back to Alpha. Got 400 to go. Oh boy, this is going to be tough. There's October and Ripley, beached sort of, not really beached, but ran out of power. 300 to Alpha, let's go, we got this. Come on. Seek fluid and take immediately. We're gonna get some uh, healing and we'll get some food. That's all good. Veronica's way, way far away. Reminder that this was our first base that we ever made. Snag that. There we go. Excellent! So I'm gonna get food first and then we'll get a first aid kit second. So this is, uh. Woo! Welcome aboard, Captain. Yeah, no kidding. Okay, give me some fruits. Inventory's full. Oh jeez. Let's get rid of these things then. Okay, let's eat. It's feast time. We're gonna eat, eat, eat. Vital signs stabilizing. Woo! I gotta replant these before I uh, kill the rest of it. So there you go, folks. Disaster averted. Disaster averted. So yeah, we're gonna have to go back to beta and make a couple power cells, go get our sub. And uh, yeah. That's kind of where we are right now. And that's some serious deliciousness there. 
So I basically have to plant it. And then... Make some seeds with it? I think so. Okay, that's good. Woo! We are full. Very nice, very nice. Okay, so I feel much better now. I'm not too fussed about... Like, that's more than enough food to get us to the, uh... Oh, you know what? Uh, we need enough space to get... Uh, actually, you know what? I'm gonna leave, uh... Fire extinguisher here. Oh, look, there's a water in here, too. I need enough room to have one health kit, which we're gonna get right above us. All right. Can't remember if I have a water building in here or not. Where's our health kit? There we go. Okay. Woo! We're good. We're very good. I might as well uh, deconstruct some of this trash here. We're gonna need a pile of uh, copper and mushrooms to make some power cells. I think it's like two batteries to do that. I'm gonna make one titanium just to get rid of some of this trash. There we go. That'll make it free up some space. So let's see here. Uh, motor vehicle bay. I think there might be one up. Above us, but let's have another peek here. Power cell is going to require two batteries and a silicon rubber. Hmm. Oh wait, 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 wait! Hang on, let me just check in here if there is anything. Uh... Not really. I do have a food bar in here, though. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna take the food bar. Leave the flares. I need, I think you need like three or four power cells too, so. We're gonna need a pile of power cells. Now we have to go back to Beta Base. There's Veronica there. Beta Base isn't too far. Let's go. Let's carry on. I know for certain that I've got a mobile vehicle builder thing at the other... Oh, do I have enough space for that? I do, okay. I want to get a couple of these so I can plant them. Grab a couple of these. How many can I hold? Just two, that's fine. They're going to give some natural light to our base. Come on, get out of there. Alright, let's go. Bumblebee, you're gonna be our savior. We're gonna be using you to go back and forth a little bit here. That's the theory anyways. I can't believe <laughs> I ran out of juice. There must I must have left something on and then it just drained on the sub. I don't know what else it could be. I don't know what else it could be. I love my yellow base. So good. I'm not sure if there's anything else I need to to uh, do with it. So we're gonna plant here two of those, and then they'll grow into uh, one of these bad boys over here, which is nice. Give a nice natural light. Now let's go inside the base. Do a little bit of inventory management. Warning. Emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. Okay, why do? Oh, because my uh, bioreactor is. Oh, I bet you that thing's drained too. This thing is totally empty. Oh, that's kind of neat how it drained all that. Okay, uh, let's. Um, I need to at least get some one thing. Oh my gosh. One in the bioreactor just to get that up and running. Let's do that. And then that'll start. And then we'll put our uh, power, power cell. Restored. 
All primary systems online. Get that charging. Get these batteries out of here. So we have enough to make another couple power cells. Let's get some... I'm not sure how many I have. Oh, I do have a couple. Okay, so we'll make a couple power cells. I g I'm gonna want to take the right ingredients. Oh, it's unpowered? Okay. Thought it would be powered by now. I'm gonna want to take enough materials to build a power cell recharger. So that's kind of the plan. Like, unless I want to dismantle that, uh, I don't know. I have to see what ingredients are involved. Home sweet home. Should probably go upstairs because I wasn't entirely sure if I had the. Uh, water filtration set. And by the way, I really like this bioreactor. I don't need nuclear rods or any of that kind of craziness. Oh, there is one. Oh, it produced salt and... Huh. Alright, I guess it is working well. So, let's see here. Let's just kind of sort out some inventory. Oh, wow, look at that. Large filtered water, plus 50. Disinfected water, plus 30. Huh. That's pretty cool. Look at all the health kits we have here. So, I'm gonna just... Oh, shoot. Warning. Uh, Emergency power only. That, like, power freaked restored. me out. All primary systems online. Dude, like, what's with your power issue? Let's have a look. Oh, it's because we're so... You know what it is? It's the scanner. Let me go shut the scanner off. We have to build up some power here. Let me shut the scanner off. It's eating a bunch of stuff. I have this new uh, mod now that shows drillable versus um, non-drillable. I haven't tried it yet, but... Actually, it really shows the one. It's kind of weird. Anyways, uh, with that off now, we're going to have much better power balance in theory yeah it should be better now although the power cell charger thing is chewing it up so this actually produces very nice water and salt which is I th actually thought you put salt in it but you actually take salt out of it well I don't really have a <laughs> I have no need for salt So that's that. I've got my copper. I can put that away. Quartz and silver. Remember all that stuff I dumped off at the uh, submarine as well. Got a cool poster. So I don't like this is basically going to give us extra 200 when it's charged. So I've got three gel sacks left. Put my poster in there and my little, that's gonna be kind of neat, my little Aurora miniature. What's in here? Oh yeah, ion cubes. Huh. Okay, so that's a good start. I've got silver and titanium left. Don't really have a whole lot of titanium. My propulsion gun, which I could probably put away for now. Put that away. Silver. Two batteries. So I should be able to make a couple power cells now. Unpowered. Really? Hmm. Well, um... It's taking its sweet time here. Let's just get this thing out of here for now. Let's see if that will help with our power. See, that's what happens when you leave the bioreactor and it just sort of fades away. I haven't had much of an issue with power, except now that I've kind of left it to 
drain out. Maybe that's the issue with the bioreactor, it's just slow. What else is eating power? The filtration machine. Ah. Oh, I see. Okay, so you know what I need? Uh, let me have a look here. I'm not sure if I've got the ingredients, but I'm gonna need to put a couple of solar power on the roof. Quartz times two. Oh, jeez, I don't have quartz. Oh, boy. Quartz time two. I'm not even sure how to stop it. Can you stop? like an off button no it'll never gain um, you know what though I can I've got the power uh, thingy here let me just see if I can shove this in here for the time being that'll help no no I need to See, the thing is, if I put the scanner on... Bioreactor is just struggling here. The thing is, I need quartz to go make a couple solar panels, so... I guess I will... Put it on and get out there and go get it. Where's my bumblebee? Passing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. We're just gonna go ahead and grab some resources for now. Definitely struggling with some power here. Oh, well. oh my god, that jelly shroom is just... I still have nightmares over that silly jelly shroom thing where I died like 20 times. Ugh. That was terrible. Okay. Couple quartz. And then uh, we can get some... Solar power running. Titanium too. Might as well just gather some stuff while we're here. Nice gold. Quartz is obviously uh, good for uh, building up glass items. I might as well get some of these too. A couple more. what I can. I basically need copper quartz and titanium I think. But the last thing I need is salt right now. Alright, this should be enough for us to kind of at least get started. I'll make maybe three or four uh, solar panels because that clearly caught me off guard. I wasn't expecting to have that much of an issue, frankly. And we still need to make some power cells, but I can't make them while I've got no power from my fabricator. Dude, I want you to drop your uh, tooth is what I want you to do. Random chunk of titanium. And we're gonna have to get some uh, mid late game items too, like gel sacks and. Uh, well, one of the items we needed was actually called nickel, which I don't even know where that is. Veronica, okay, let's go back to our base. I think we've got a good amount of quartz to get started with. 
definitely lose a lot more water than I do food. I think there's actually like a special scuba... 30 seconds. A special scuba outfit that actually retains your water. I don't know. I don't know if it's worth building or not. Well, I'd have to go find the... The code for it or whatever, the blueprint. So... so. We will see. There is a lot more left. We are roughly halfway into the game and uh, definitely a lot more crazy exciting things ahead. This is perhaps a little more of a maintenance episode, but um, you know, sometimes you gotta have a little bit of just building and it's okay because it takes a bit of pressure off, you know what I mean? So let's put three in each maybe. That's kind of nice. Last time I had this planet so close, it, uh, oh, I guess we'll go for in that one. Yeah, see, Warning. it's struggling. Emergency power only. Struggling power restored. Power. All primary systems online. So I'm going to turn the scanner off. Hopefully that will give me enough juice for the fabricator. And I bet you that power cell has died. Damn. Okay, so we're definitely struggling with some power situations. And here I was going on and on. Oh, the bioreactor is so good. Well, yeah, unless you let it run dry, I guess. Silly, silly thing. Welcome aboard, Captain. So I need copper. Let's grab a few coppers. Thing is definitely uh, let me go shut that scanner off because that is eating up a whole pile of uh... there we go I'm guessing that power cell is done and I have no idea how to shut this thing off although it's producing water nicely though this thing is just uh, struggling here to keep up Struggling to keep up, are ya? And maybe the... Well, I don't know. Okay, we said we were going to try... Yeah, see, this thing is dead again. And it won't take batteries, it only takes uh, power cells, so yeah. Get that health kit. So let me just make uh oh you know what I don't actually need the well duh I don't actually need the fabricator to make a couple of these bad boys here These are just practical for smaller bases, but I guess I need them now for this big base. And if, if you're uh, offended by my lack of ability to mark that perfectly in terms of its orientation, oh well, I will not allow my OCD to... I will not allow your OCD to get in the way of my fun. Okay, so we need uh, titanium. I think we're good there. So let's get um, a couple of these bad boys up here. If I can get maybe a series of four, that would be at least something. Of course, now it's like nighttime, but I just hope I'm, I'm at 61 meters. It shouldn't be too deep. At least during the day, this will charge, and that'll not let the whole thing drain out. That's the theory, anyways. Okay, let's have a look at our power now. Oh, I gotta be inside. Hello! So, there's not really much we can do until we actually have a bit of power to... ...take care of some business. Oh, it actually added about 100. Let's see here. Solar power is adding nothing. Oh, it adds 75 each. Oh, wow. So, it added 300. Hmm. Filtration unit must be in a, a pile. 
Yeah, it's like every little speck is going into either the filtration machine or the power cell. Oh boy. Well, I got more salt I don't need. Okay, so let's get that off. When it hits day, we'll be in a much better position. Chunk of gold. Teeth and lead. That's a great combination. Teeth and lead. Silver. Mushroom and gold. Our gold is absolutely full. Guess we're putting gold in there. All right, so yeah, what do we want to look at? I want to look at the cost of building one of these bad boys. So two rubies, advanced wiring kit, and two titanium. Advanced wiring kit. Two rubies. Let's see what the advanced wiring kit is. Seriously, I don't have any power to it. Ugh. Damn, boy. I mean, the nice thing is that this water is definitely continuing to spit out. Should probably just use up some of this cheaper water, I guess. Um, let me just give it a shot of this power cell that's charging here. 61%. That'll at least help me with the fabricator. I need to make a couple more quick power cells. And then we're good. There we go. Two batteries. Alright, so that's good for that. So I'm gonna... I don't actually don't even know how many the sub needs to be honest. Dude, you're noisy. Okay, so that'll help me at least with a little bit here, and then I can put that in there. And we'll charge. Basically, we're stealing from one power cell to give to the other, if that makes any sense. Still needs more. Plant that. Maybe I do need a nuclear reactor. Here I was getting all settled in and now I'm starting to have second guesses. I might need it. I don't know, that means uh, more late game stuff. So, so I've got uh, titanium, I've got myself rubies, and I need an advanced wiring kit. So let's have a little peek at what that's requiring. Basically, it's two silver, two gold, and a computer chip. Oof. Two silver, two gold. What else we need? And a computer chip. What's a computer chip need? One gold, a copper wire. So I need two coppers and another gold. See, that's why I got that red coral. I knew I was gonna need it. Jeez, we're getting low on all sorts of stuff here. Yeah, that's gonna be tough. Uh, anyways, we've gotta set up the sub. I've gotta have some backup power cells there, or it's uh, gonna be a problem. So let's see, what, what did we get? What did we get? I've got myself wiring kit. I need advanced wiring kit. So 
So now what does that get me? That sh I should have everything I need to build that. Yes, I do. Advanced wiring kit, two rubies, two titanium. Power cell one. This one's at 92. That was my bioreactor. I think our power is starting to climb up here. My reactor still struggling. Oh, the solar panel. Ah, the solar panel is kicking into gear here. So I think what I'll do is I'm going to slurp this up. Throw it in my charger here. I want to go back to the sub is what I want to do. I just don't know how many power cells I'm going to need. But if I can get these two to 100 and then maybe make one more power cell, I think four should do it. That's my hope. That is what I'm hoping for. Four power cells, and then we'll go and uh, feed the beast. I should actually get enough to make a fabricator while I'm at it. So titanium, gold, and table coral. Okay. Titanium, gold. Grab one of each of those. So that way I have a fabricator also on the sh the submarine. This guy's still doing pretty good. I uh, that's the plan. That'll be uh, where we cut it today. I'm gonna make sure that I get some good food. We want to make sure we've got four power cells. This definitely, definitely the solar panel is helping during the day. My bi reactor is just struggling to do anything useful. But the solar panel is definitely uh, helping out big time. And we're going to take a bumblebee out once the uh, power cells are charged up. Because I have everything I needed and they are charged up. Alright, so I have four power cells and enough materials to make a power cell charger and a fabricator on our submarine. Let's get out of here. I'm going to grab a couple more food here. as well. Uh, I think I accidentally, uh, ah, shoot. Uh, you know what? We'll just put these in here for now. I accidentally ate. Let's see if that helps me out here. Okay, so now I've got some of these. This is good. All right, I think we're good. Let's get into Bumblebee and get out of here. We've got to go find the Red October. Hey, Bumblebee. Oh, you need a little bit of repair. Do you not need repair? Why am I not able to repair you? There we go. Remember I left a bunch of stuff in the uh, Red October, because I, you know, I had a bunch of Captain. So nothing there. Okay, so let's go. Bumblebee, let's go get Red October in Ripley. All systems online. Oh, don't run into our moon pool. Poor Veronica. Don't worry, we're gonna get Veronica eventually. First order of business is Ripley in Red October. Can't believe I literally ran out of uh, battery on those things. It's kind of a rookie mistake there. Definitely a rookie mistake. So, uh, order of business when we arrive. Swap out the power cores. Install the power cell charger and the fabricator. Oh my lord, I just got hit by a bunch of poppin'. Good grief, that hurt. Ouch. I don't know, oh yeah, we have 64 damage, or I guess hull availability, whatever. There it is, it's coming into focus. I wanted to take uh, Ripley out and r for our maiden voyage, and we did, but uh, I probably was not as prepared as I should have been. Emergency power only. 
Oxygen see production. What the heck I'm doing here. All right, let's go and uh, swap out some power cells. Otherwise, we got no air. Let's see. There's the lid for Ripley. Okay, so it looks like it needs three of them. Okay, I was estimating. I wasn't sure. Of course it needs three. Maybe it's because I left the internal lights on or something? I don't know. I don't know. Oh my god, it takes six! Holy moly. That is a lot. That is definitely a lot. Uh, Alright, so let's go ahead and... Uh, I really probably should just, uh, cause there's a nice clean wall in here, but a power cell's kinda awkward, isn't it? Let's put it here, I guess? What I'm not entirely sure is, basically we're gonna use the power cell to charge the power cell, you know what I mean? Not sure how I feel about that, but we'll leave that like that. And then I think the fabricator. Just throw it up uh, here, maybe. And I think while we're here, we will actually create a wall locker. I like having the uh, wall lockers up here. Well, actually, you know what? We'll put two. That way, it's just a little more convenient. So these things are drained. I guess I could probably charge them back, but... For now, we'll leave it like that. And uh, we need to turn off these lights. I think maybe that's what's draining it. Maybe? Internal lighting off. Maybe that, that'll help with its power. Let's see how much we got. 62%. Okay, let's uh, bring... Uh, bring Red October back here. It looks fairly clean. Come back for our friend here later. Gotta keep an eye on the power consumption. Here's Veronica. Well, park our uh, submarine back at the base. Oh, look, there's Alpha Base. I feel like this is super shallow. Man, that is getting real close. I mean, I know that late game we're going to need the sub because we're going to go super deep and Ripley's going to be our hero. He's going to be grappling up the place. Got to watch the pop in here. At least we've got our friend back. And I'm curious because we are about 60% on the battery. So... Okay, so it's basically... Roughly 10% to get it back to base. Alright, so let's park this bad boy. I don't know, somewhere around here is fine. Alright, we did it! We got Ripley back and we got... Engine powering down. October back. Woo! Got ourselves a couple uh, storage lockers, a fabricator, and our 
I'm kind of curious with the power off. Oh, jeez, look at that. I can't even get through this door. Okay, well, I guess Fabricator is not going to go there. <laughs> uh, I guess we'll put Fabricator on this wall. Anyways, uh, yeah, so we're good. I've got myself uh, sort of organized. Looks like I'm going to need a couple more power cell chargers because this thing is definitely uh, chewing up the batteries here. Wow, look at that. He's already at zero. Wow. That was zero. That's 75. They, those were both 100, and now they're... This thing is like a battery hog. Okay, we're going to have to work on that, but for now, I'm super excited. I'm so happy that we've got Red October, and we survived. We, uh, You know what we haven't done, and I promised we would do it? We're going to do it right now. Before I forget. I want to go up to the surface to our uh, mobile factory thingamajiggy and let's have a look at our end game build and then we'll call it a little longer episode today but ah it's all part of the fun this is one of those games where it's so easy to get sucked in and time flies okay, so let's have a look at what we need to build for our uh, end game here Neptune escape rocket so wow we could actually build that in the next episode what stay tuned for that folks we are going to continue our adventures with Subnautica I'm your Gibbs and we'll see you soon